Former Major League players, Dontre Wills, Willis, Vladimir Guerrero, and even Roger Clemens at one point are playing or have played in the Atlantic League of the professional baseball clubs. And the league has agreed to put a team in Virginia Beach if a group of local investors can build them a home. It is an interesting concept. The team would play in a small but quaint 6,000 seat ballpark and the ownership group wants to build as many as a dozen baseball fields around the park to host youth baseball tournaments. The commissioner of the league, Joe Klein, says this is just the type of situation that his independent league likes. I think the demographics here are outstanding for the Atlantic League. I think they're outstanding for minor league baseball. And uh, I, I, I think your peculiar um, traffic patterns keep people from attending baseball games. And I think the addition of Virginia Beach to professional baseball is, uh, is going to be a very big plus for the area. Baseball LLC. The ownership group is led by Jay Short, who feels the Atlantic League can make it in Hampton Roads. His plans are to raise $25 million, maybe more, to build the complex, which he would like to see near the Virginia Beach Sportsplex, if he can work things out with Virginia Beach officials. Virginia Beach is the biggest city in the entire country not to have or have ever had professional baseball. The area is very ripe for minor league baseball. Uh, we'd like to have a 360 degree stadium that has seats about 6,000 and then has a berm that holds another two or 3,000 so children can sit in their seats for a couple innings with their parents then go out and play catch on the berm, walk around the stadium, come back and sit with their parents. They're not necessarily trapped to their seat. The Atlantic League has teams in, well, a team in Texas, which averages over 6,600 fans a game. They've got one on Long Island, two in New Jersey, two in Pennsylvania, one in Connecticut, and one in Southern Maryland. And investors in Fredericksburg hope to build a stadium there and get a team. The league averages just over 4,000 fans a game. So Mr. Short has a league that wants to give him a team. Now I would assume that he has to work with the city of Virginia Beach to try and get a location, presumably by the sportsplex, and then find enough investors to kick in around 30 $30 million dollars to build the complex. I'll stay on top of the story and let you know how it develops.